Hey guys, it's uh, Monday morning, June 1st, and uh, for those of you who've been following the build up, it's uh, day one of the Gym of Fitness 30 Days of Fitness Challenge, 30 days of continuous training uh, with myself putting together a program for me and Louis to get involved in. Uh, a little bit nervous just because it's, uh, it's quite a step up from what we've been doing over the last couple of months where we've probably had our foot off the pedal a little bit when it comes to training and routine and discipline so it should be interesting. Day one is going to be a 5k run but nice and gentle just to see where we are. We're going to come back in the afternoon and sort out an ab session online so everyone uh, like and subscribe on YouTube and yeah we hope you enjoy the vlog. I'm going to get a shave at some point today as well. I'm already a little bit concerned about the heat. It's already shaping up to be one of the hottest days of the year and we're going for a run. Does this look like a man who's ready to take on 30 days of relentless fitness training, ready to change their lifestyle, ready to work harder than he's ever worked before? Let's have a look. You all right? What's up? <laughs> This is the field where a lot of this painful training is going to be taking place over the next month. He's looking a little bit nervous. Uh, yeah, so like I said, we're going to do a dynamic warm up, get ourselves ready, and then start going around that fifth place for our first run of the challenge. dynamic warm-up getting ourselves ready for the day uh, now we're just doing a quick walk over to the starting line that I've set up for our first run of the of the month of the challenge which is going to be a nice gentle 5k just to see where we are just to kind of rate our current fitness I'm going to explain a little bit more as we go along but um, there will be longer runs involved in this challenge so gonna set us up over here by the start line and yeah wish us luck Our 5k. This has been way tougher than I thought. The heat is it's hot, and Louis is obviously doing extra there with his. He's got his chest mount for his GoPro, and he's got his backpack on as well with our batteries. This is tough. We've got a lot of work to do this month. That was tough. Unremarkable time, but considering we've not run, I'll put up my Strava stats. We've not run for two or three weeks now. Yeah. And when you factor in the, the way our nutrition has been the last few weeks, terrible. That was hard work. Not that was hard work. A lot of room for improvement. Of next month, uh, we're going to keep revisiting runs once or twice a week uh, and look at our progress there. What do you want to add? 32 minutes, right? Uh, the last time we ran a 5k in this park in Hollywood, it was like 38 minutes, and that was about three weeks ago when. That was when there'd been no chance, so. Yeah, and <coughs> even like weeks before that, we had like no fitness done, so that was a 38 minute 5k. This one's 32, you say. So that's a little bit better, but you know, it's not anywhere near that we should be doing. This is where we're going to start. Yeah. Like I say, we're going to revisit these runs once or twice a week. Similar sort of route, making sure it's fair. Um, that was tough. We're going to get a, a cool down going. Then we're going to stretch out. And then we'll be meeting back later online for our ab session. See you in a bit.
Maybe he's heading home now. I'll do a better wave. That'll do. Lou's going back. Get together, then we're going to try and kind of virtual PT experience and we're going to get on Zoom later. We're going to go through an ab circuit and then give you a little bit more information about the routine with regards to our nutrition. You'll be seeing this tonight. Yep. So that was the first first run, first bit of exercise of our 30 day challenge. It was tough. The, the sun, the heat, the lack of training. This is me and Louis going off the back of two, three weeks of poor nutrition, no real routine exercise. We're going to be doing these bi-weekly runs, see how we can progress using a pretty similar route. Uh, we'll see what we can get to with that. So for now, quick shower, change, got a little bit of work to do, and then I will meet up again with Louis via Zoom later on to do an ab workout, posting a separate link to the full workout for another time this week. If anyone else wants to get involved and use that routine. So we're live now from the garden. There isn't the space for me to be doing one-to-one -one sessions out here, so we're using technology here, and we are getting Louis live on Zoom. See if you can get a look at this. Hello. So it about one second up, hold it one second, and then one second down. So let's go up. Hold it like that. I'll do it with you now. So we're going three, two, one, let's go. Go night. Seven. No, no, that's one. That's one. Good, I'm gonna do it with you. That's two, let's go. Three. Are you going up? Yep, let's go. <laughs> the angles are important. <laughs> Outside the call it the studio, the shed. Louis already working hard on edits in there. There's <laughs> only one person allowed in there at a time, obviously following social distancing rules. We've got probably the biggest cat you'll ever see. <laughs> Sitting there. Just wanted to talk a little bit about nutrition, the rules for this challenge, because obviously it's gonna play a massive factor in how well we achieve the, the targets we've set out. So with regards to nutrition, there's going to be three key rules in this challenge. Rule one, 2000 calories or less per day. And this is in order for us to get the deficit that we need to hit that fat loss target that we're looking for. Rule two, track your macronutrients. And rule three, everything must be tracked. No cheating, uh, no snacks that aren't included. Everything that we eat in this day, everything that we eat every day is going to be tracked and put onto MyFitnessPal. Uh, we're going to be tracking all of our exercise and our runs through Fitbit and through Strava and I'm personally going to be taking more of an intermittent fasting approach so therefore I will be also using an app called Zero, uh, which I'll show you now as well and that's going to track my intermittent fasting and my, my feeding hours and my fasting hours. Uh -huh. 